to. Yeah. <laughs> I believe we are live. What's going on, everybody, and welcome to the Sunday Night Baseball and Football live stream. Houston Astros try to go two and zero oh against. Well, that guy in the middle is really short. Yeah, it's tough. T tough time to be a short guy between two like six five guys. <laughs> Uh, speaking of, we have a special announcement to celebrate the baseball playoff seat geek. The official ticket marketplace of major league baseball is giving all of you 10% off your next purchase with code John boy postseason. That's right. 10% off. That's 10% more than you would have gotten if you didn't have the code John Boy Postseason. It does not matter what you're buying or if you bought from SeatGeek before. All you have to do is use code John Boy Postseason and get yourself 10% off. It's really a good deal if you ask me. And SeatGeek is here to help you for all of MLB playoffs and more. So go get your code today. Being as neutral as possible, it would be cool if the Twins win so we can get a series. Yeah, well, if the Astros win, it's series over. Well, they just protected home. That's it. Yeah, well, but the series is not a series until a home team wins. and sad until a road team wins. Road team wins. I want the Twins to win. Because also it'd be much more fun having their first, like the game in Minnesota, not be do or die. Oh, yeah. Right. I guess, I think I'm rooting for your Don Homers. Like if you're Don. That was a great at bat. Ooh. Polanco flips it. Love that. He's seen the ball so well. He is. He loves it. Hitting second. Lance in the chat kind of just echoed my point. I feel like I don't want every series to be a sweep. We had that in the wild We card. need a juicy series. I, need a, I have Phillies and Braves as our juicy series, but I need another one. We haven't seen a one-to-one -one series. No, I need some balance. <laughs> I need a two-to-one yeah. series. Yes. I need it. Yeti. Yeti. I, it's not that I never watched it. I've watched it. <laughs> All right. Oh! Did he get it? No, no way. He got it. No, he might have gotten that. Oh, he got some of it. It's off the wall. Warehouse rules. And the Minnesota Twins. Correa doing that is that's huge. That's huge. How did that ball not get out? It felt like he smoked that. He should have pulled it more. It felt like it should have been a fly ball. Got a little under it, but beautiful swing. He knows how to lead that team. Yeah, too many bets. Oh! Kyle Farmer! Oh, that's Trevor Ploof! That was way good! Ploof! Give him a minute so we don't spoil it. <laughs> oh, shit. That was way gone. Josie, you might be right. Three, Forever might be getting rocked two, tonight. One. They're seeing him. Call him. That was a beautiful. How did he get his hands in? Oh, shit. Touchdown, George Kittens. What the hell? That was crazy. What a swing. Trev's having a big day. He might I not pick up. I thought I took the twins. Trevor Ploof. Dick Storiali. Dick Storiali, you're here. Uh, you're on speakerphone with my family. So watch yourself, bro. You're on, you're on speakerphone with our family. We're streaming. I know you are. My boy, I, I swear I just told Olivia this. I was going to write a text saying my best friend Kyle Farmer is going to take Framber up top today. And I just didn't do it. Why? Always send that text, you know? Always send that. Always send that. Because it doesn't even matter. But you know what? Hey, I'm happy. <laughs> Three nothing. Let's go. Fran I mean, throwing a first pitch fastball to Kyle Farmer, a.k.a. the modern-day Trevor Plouffe. What's he thinking? My fingerprints are all over Kyle Farmer. <laughs> <laughs> I bet. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Correa was thinking the same thing Abun was thinking. I'm hitting a grand slam next pitch. Yeah. Yeah. That was a sneaky great pitch. Imagine yes. if the guy in third stole home there. That was a dot. <laughs> <laughs> I wish guys stole home more. I really do. I get why they don't, but like. Jake, who's winning this up at? Um, I think we walk away and say it's neutral. Double play. Whoa! Oh, oh, one run score. score. That might be the game. Should Framber have been in for that? No. I don't know, man. Damn, that's sick. Carlos Correa against his former team. And Free now, RBI game. Dusty now you're pulling him. All right, Dusty. I, I get the confidence, but it's a little, a little bit of a long leash. Yeah, I don't know. 
Would you have gone May Maytown against him? I think so. I think you got to get Framber out of the game. Not at that point. That whole inning was weird, man. Oh, I meant to, I was peeing earlier, and I, I <laughs> thought of this question, and I meant to ask you guys. Have you guys ever been to, like, a real stinker, like, playoff game? Yes. Like, you were really excited yes. to go, and Me it just Me and Jimmy's sucked? first time meeting. Yes. I took him to the Yankees against Red Sox. Red Sox, and it rained. Was this an a was this the, like, Brock, Brock Holt cycle game? Yes. Yeah. Oh. That's exactly the game. We got wrecked. That sucks. And we were there while Jimmy came all this way to watch this game, and we were just there. I never leave games early anyway. And Jimmy was cold too, so he had his, you know, he's coming mm. from Cali, he's still kind of warm, and he had gloves Damn. on. That, that, as a Red Sox fan, that was fun, but that sucks. That was bad. I had that with the, um, the Bruins. I paid for a oh, game. Yeah. Paid for a game seven. Game seven, right? Oh, so they laid an egg. Best team ever. <laughs> Damn. That one sucked. That was a great game, Joe's. I remember it a little different. With a chance to close it out, Correa oh, flex no on way. him. Flex on him. Put it in the arm. Woo! That's the shortstop Did you, you replaced me with. Did Get you see here. the umpire's call on him? Yeah, he went crazy. He, he brought up the back leg. Oh. <laughs> Heard your hip pop, bro. No. Heard your hip that pop. That was a nut. That's against Pena Play. to end the game. That matters. I wish there was a way to tell people that like don't know baseball. If you actually stand that, on the dime, Joe, people just we were talking about career, but everyone's just talking about your goddamn <laughs> hip, bro. What happened, <laughs> bro? <laughs> dude, your hip crack was crazy. <laughs> Was you like, are you, are you, wait, wait, are you hurt? No, no, guys, relax. Dude, you know, <laughs> you life alert? What just happened? It was crazy. Guys, relax, guys. It sounded like, like Correa just made it, like. You got, Correa with the most athletic play, like, Minnesota, ever, and then you get up from, in a crack. A Minnesota <laughs> legendary play. It's overshadowed by Joseph's <laughs> hip. You get up, no one cares about it. You get up to mimic the umpire. <laughs> Joe's is your hair out. Damn, boo. <laughs> we're all trying to react uh, to an insane boy. athletic feat, and we're like, our hips are... Hit. What was it? It was like, it was my spine. I don't know, man. Bro, what? I think it was your hip. <laughs> your spine makes that noise, and... We gotta take you to the He's hospital. Just, I thought the mic popped. <laughs> Joe, Joe, we all peaked. We need that. I need to replay it. Back. Guys. I need to hear it. <laughs> the umpire was like. <laughs> <laughs> hey. This is why we do it. <laughs> he even imitated the umpire's hip age. <laughs> this is why we do it. 